Hey guys, welcome back in Python series. So we already talked about the basic concept behind Python data types. What exactly it is and how it works. So there are total five different data types present in Python. The first is numeric, the second is Boolean, the third is set, and the fourth is mapping, and the fifth is sequence. So in numeric, we have integer, float, complex, and in sequence, we have a string, list, tuple. So what is the main point here? Today, we are going to cover the sequence data type, which is list, the particular list. I open the Visual Studio code. The first question is, what is list? Okay, so basically list are used to store multiple items in a single variable. Okay, if I take example of any box, if I have a box, in this box, I can store anything like chocolate and toffee, pen, pencil, rubber, anything. So whatever I want. So just like a container, we can store any value in a single variable. Okay, cool. So this is the definition of list. Okay, how to define list? We use a square bracket. We use this square bracket to store multiple values okay so this work like a container okay. so the first uh, we will start create a list okay so how to create i have a variable my list i have and now store whatever you want in this container like inside this square bracket so i'm storing apple banana cherry orange okay cool so this is my list i created a new list okay i created a new list this list is not empty because in this list it have a four item present this concept okay so what is the very very important point here the first is ordered items are ordered and uh, changeable and uh, allow duplicate so these are three uh, points you have to remember ordered changeable allow duplicate so what is the meaning of ordered okay if i have this list all items present every single item have has order this order like this item is in this position and this item is in this position this item is in this position so this is have uh, ordered so we cannot change this but this uh, in python list there are many method present by applying this we can change we can change the order of a particular item we will we will see in the next uh, point what is what are the methods are there so that we can change the order okay so the second point is changeable the meaning of changeable is that if i have this list so that we can add something we can remove something and we can insert anything in between two items so this is the meaning of change we can change the structure of any list so this is the meaning of change okay allow duplicate allow duplicate that meaning if i have this apple in the this position if i have apple in the this position so maybe in a different position i again have has this apple apple item so but how how it can allow duplicate these items are indexed the first item has index zero the first item has index zero the second one the third two and the fourth three basically we start from a zero zero number and zero index so this point is very very important to keep in mind okay so we learn the three concept order changeable allow duplicate and how to create a list okay 
if i want to know which data types uh, present here and so we already talk about the type method there's a type method so by which using which we can identify uh, the data type of any variable okay so i want to know the data type of my list so print type my list list it is a list data type okay cool so if i want to know the length of my list how many items are there so use print len method so there are total four items present in this list uh, if i have a uh, different values uh, in a container but or it is not a list it is not a list but i want to convert this container into list so how is here the concept of list constructor list one i want to convert this container into list how so use list list container outside uh, this box and it will convert into list so if i print if i print my list one it is giving me the output one two three four in a square bracket inside a square bracket so that means i can watch it my box my container in list into list so that's a very very important concept here i uh, right here in teaser values float values boolean values uh, uh, any type of data types can i store yes list items can be of any data types okay list item can be of any data types for example i created a list one is equals to one two three four five list two is equals to true this is a boolean false okay. list 3 is equals to float values 1.1 2.2 and list 3 is equals to any values or oh, okay any values but in list 4 i want i am inserting one comma in string a integer comma string comma uh comma boolean comma float value yes a list can contain different data types a list with a string integer boolean values and float values so this is also uh, another concept which is very very important in so basically the definition of list is that Key, uh, mul we can store multiple items in a single variable so this is a list for is a single variable we can um, we can store multiple values okay cool hey if you enjoy this video and you are enjoying this whole python series so don't forget to like subscribe and share and uh, because we are going to make a lot of videos on python language as well as uh, different programming language so yeah Bye and take care.